Hey, Nasty Besties, Owlettes, how is everybody doing today? Happy Wednesday, Camel Hump Day. Oh yeah, halfway through the week. Congratulations to our new members. We have Welfare Girl, we've got Cat Chloe, Tish, Lilith, and Cahoots received free memberships, a gifted membership for you just to start off the stream. Why not? Why not? And, uh, and welcome. Yeah, yeah. Welcome, new members. Nice to have you. And Sir Austin, thank you so much for the super chat. Operation Dessert Storm Snack Attack. <laughs> yeah, I love it. Snack Attack. <laughs> thank you, Cabello. Thank you, Sir Austin. Thank you so much. <laughs> Snack Attack. You guys are so creative. Oh my God. All the names. It's hilarious. Hey, Tony D. Tony D, I sent you a picture today on Throne. I hope you got it. If not, take a look later. Oh my God. The candy crown. Oh yeah. I mean, it's Operation Dessert Storm, of course. And we have, uh, I think the person is in the chat. Let me take a quick look who we have to credit for that idea. Oh my god, so funny. I giggled uh, when I saw that. Let's see. Dirt Merchant. Dirt Merchant came up with this idea for Operation Dessert Storm. And I love it. So I ran with it. I did. I did. I did. Yeah, we have to. I'm always looking for good uh, AI ideas. Very much so, Dirt Merchant. Yes. I love all the puns. I, I love it all. I love it. It is a brilliant idea. <laughs> Oh, hey, Sapphire, how are you? Desserty dozen. Uh huh. Uh -huh. She bought those um, bath salts, didn't think she fit in a tub. Yeah, I know, Anna Gags, right? Like, Epsom salts. Like, why? I don't know. I don't know. So, if you're not sure what Operation Dessert Storm is all about, basically, Chantal is selling out Harry. She said that she was going to return to Kuwait for her husband and for Julia, but conveniently forgot to include Harry. So what is Harry supposed to do? He's like just struggling there by himself. And it, what is he supposed to do? He's so little. He's so little. The poor guy. My gosh. So look, he has his own little tank. He has a military tank and it's Operation Desert Storm. So there's candies flying around like grenades. Look at Harry. He's so, I mean, he's so distraught. Chantal completely forgot about him. So he's out there on his own. I mean, my gosh. You hope Harry's still alive, Francis? He's with us now. Yeah, <laughs> he's with us now. He's one of ours. No one puts Harry in the corner. That's right, Alexis. We'll take him. You don't want him, Chantal? We'll take him. Mm-hmm. Your kiddo loves the artwork, 31 frames. Awesome. Drives the tank into Chantal's toes. Let's hope so. Let's hope so. Yeah, lose a toenail. Hamsters don't live that long. How many Harrys are there? I don't know. We try not to think of that, you know. He's small but mighty. I love that, Tony D. Looks like he's fighting in Candyland. <laughs> Pretty much. Pretty much. By the way, everybody, I don't know if you're aware, but... um. Poison Petty Four had a birthday yesterday. Yes, she did. Happy birthday, Poison Petty Four. Happy, happy birthday. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Get on down, everybody. 
Do a little twerking modestly, please. Keep it modest and keep it quick. <laughs> oh, she can sue me. I would welcome it. Poison Petty for <laughs> Yeah. Thank you, Salah. Thank you. And happy birthday, Poison Petty for Awesome. Awesome. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna put the person's name on the screen now, I think. You know, let's stop with the generic stuff. You know, let's personalize everything. We can, so why not? They took his dignity, he'll take their lives, Harry the Hamster Stars in Harambo first meal. Oh my god. <laughs> of course. Okay. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> The bath soaks were for Salah. He loves his rubber ducky time. He does. He does. So we have pictures of his feet coming out of that tub. And he was giving himself a little bubble bath. Yeah. Feeling all, uh, you know, feeling himself in the bathtub. Taking pictures of his feet. Sending them to random people. He also took another picture of himself, if you know what I mean. Do you know what I mean? I mean... Mm -mm. You can probably guess. By eggplant, I mean dick. Yeah, basically eggplant. He took a picture of his eggplant. So if you are fairly new to the community, welcome. Hi. Um, Chantal's husband, he did go live today on the couple's channel. Okay, Salah and Chantal. And he went for a walk, just like he did in Thailand. And, um, you know, one of Chantal's former Beezers, uh, just, they were just chatting. And he took it to the private DMs private let me dm you from my private account home alone legend one <laughs> and then he got all nasty i just have to i have to let people know in case they don't know and a reminder if somehow you were able to get this awful image out of your head that you know we're gonna be watching his live stream his little stroll and I just want you to think of how nasty he is. Very, very nasty. So he took photos of his feet and sent them to Kybella. And he also took a picture of his eggplant and sent it to Kybella. By eggplant, I mean dick. So let's keep that in mind when we're, um, when we're looking at Chantal's dear husband. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Eggplant with the odd shaping of the shrubbery around it. And luckily, the version I saw was completely blacked out. I really didn't see anything. Just, you know, his navel, you know, his hairy navel. And, you know, Chantal does say that, uh, you know, he's hairy all over. We didn't need to know that. I realize we didn't need to know that at all. But um, she let us know. She let us know. He's hairy all over. In case, and I'm not talking about Harry the Hamster either. No, I'm not, actually. <sighs> yeah. So. <laughs> and his horrible triangle manscaping, Lucy Jane. I mean, uh, all right. Not, you know, I don't want to rekindle this, but necessarily. But if you're going to take a picture and send it to people that you're trying to seduce, wouldn't you do a little grooming first? Or wouldn't you at least like take a picture, like a really good picture, and then just keep it on hand to send out to whoever you're trying to, um, you know, I don't know, woo with that? Like, why would you send such an awful picture? It was terrible. It was terrible. <laughs> you do love the sound bite of her saying to shove it up his hairy butt. Me too. Me too. I've got it someplace, somewhere. Let's see if I can find it. Yeah, shove it up his hairy butt like, ew, Chantal, we don't need to know that. He's your husband, okay? Keep him over there. We don't, we don't want that. We don't, we just, you know, I'll speak for myself, I guess only, maybe some of you do, but I don't need to know where the hair is on his body. I truly don't. I'm just, mm-mm. I can't think of Salah as anything but, like, a boy. Like a 18, 19-year-old little boy. You know? He, you know? 
You know, you know what I'm saying? I think you do. I just can't see him any other way. Oh, here it is. I, it was only this once. <laughs> yeah, sure. Fuck you. Fuck you. See this finger? Shove it up your fucking hairy ass. <sighs> she was pretty stressed, you know, and uh, she told us more than we needed to know. Mm -hmm. The sound bite is unfortunately stuck in your brain forever and you didn't ask for it. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Fatty DeFed, how's it going? Woof, woof is right. Ugh. How do you possibly? Okay, I mean, how? Number one. It's just like, <laughs> it's so demeaning in the first place, okay, that he's even talking to other women, like the second you leave the country, basically. And then, and then oh, God. Your husband. He can't even pretend to be decent. He can't even pretend. Ugh. And now you're bringing him back into the fold and everyone's just supposed to be cool with it after what he said? There were some terrible things that were said. 39 and none of the kinky stuff anymore. That's right. She's, she's reformed. You know, she's like very vanilla, so. I'm 39. I'm f***ing diabetic and I'm not into weird fetishes anymore right exactly i mean 39 diabetic and not into weird fetishes what fun is that none none at all uh-uh-uh the best soundbite is i gave up my cats away for oh yeah oh yeah i gave my cats away for you <laughs> i gave my cats away for you uh, yeah well you're a moron he's a changed man little seven do you think so i don't know if i buy that I don't know. He said, at least he can pick up Kybella. At least I can pick you up. I love you both, but I can pick you up. It's, I mean, it's a fact. That video gave a lot of fun sound bites. Oh my God. The best. Mm-hmm. Yep. Dot, I gave up my cats for you. I could have been married by now, right? Yes. I know. I know. All right. Let's, uh, I don't know if you have seen Salah's uh, walking video yet. It's just as exciting as when he was in Thailand walking around and Chantal's in the chat just like before. So super exciting, as you can imagine. And um, he's just kind of narrating. Da, 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 da. And but here's the thing. I recorded the chat with it because my understanding is that the best part of this live stream was the chat and I recorded it in real time. So anything that was deleted, we're, st we're gonna see it first. We're gonna see it. So, look at little Harry over there, crouching. I got you, Harry, don't worry, just relax. It's okay, it's okay. Uh, you saw an even older clip recently of her when she still had hair saying she's kink shaming when it comes to scat stuff. So she's not into it, Francis. Oh. I think she could get into it, though. I think she could. I think she could. <laughs> the chat was spicy. Awesome. All is forgiven, Tater Tot Hot Dish. That's right. No problems here. Like, they've been together for 25 years or something. And, like, you know, everyone makes mistakes. Okay. Okay. He is boring, Alexis. I agree. Beauty block. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Diabetes Wonderland, a book lover review. It Yeah, it's Operation Dessert Storm. Mm-hmm. Because Chantal's leaving, uh, leaving Harry out. Leaving him out to fight. Ugh, we will protect him. That's right, Rosebud. Hey, BB, how's that going? How many were in his live? I actually didn't have a moment to look because I was working. So I was doing that kind of below all my other apps. So I didn't get to see. Yeah, I didn't notice at all. If anyone else did, please uh, speak up and let us know. The woman who sharded her pants on stream and laid the pants on the kitchen counter. I mean, when if he saw that, no wonder he was so attracted. No wonder he was so, like, oh, she's into it. Mm-hmm. I bet I could get her to, uh, through around 200, Alexis. Okay, that sounds reasonable for a midday stream for the couple's channel. And I have questions about that. Why is he back on the couple's channel? He has his own channel. Why is he on the couple's channel? 
How many Beezers have to steal your man before you keep them off your channel? I know, right? We got Dee Dee Lulu. You know, Kyvella swept in. She doesn't want him, but, you know, she proved her point. It's like, yeah, you keep bringing him on. Whether, you know, whether anyone likes her supposed men or not, they're doing it despite her. And I don't know, she doesn't get it, I guess. It's more important to her to be able to flex. <laughs> well, I feel like I'm talking to a real dog. Woof, woof. <laughs> she just uploaded again, JB? Okay. Is it like a mukbang or something? Ugh. Ugh. Boring. Let me take a quick look. Let's take a quick look. Did I get a notification? Out of shape at the Upper Canada Bird Sanctuary. Oh, let's watch that. That sounds good. That sounds, <laughs> that sounds legit. Okay, let me just download it very quickly. Yeah, that sounds good. <laughs> the Bird Sanctuary. I wonder if there'll be any owls there. If she even looks the wrong way at an owl, I'm going to be pissed. It has 50 views. What's going on, guys? Nothing's going on, guys. That's my non-premium account. That's what's going on there. Guys, learn to read. Hooked on phonics? That's the ad I got. Hooked on phonics. Jeez, YouTube. What are you trying to say? God. Oh. Out of shape at the Upper Canada Bird Sanctuary. Hmm. Well, I don't like her around animals, period. So that's already an issue. And animals that are at a sanctuary need needed sanctu you know, needed needed to be saved from something. And I don't like that she's involved somehow. I don't, not at all. But uh yeah, we'll watch that first then. We'll get right into that. One eight hundred ABCDEFG Yeah. She can't afford to support both Salah and Nader and her eating habits. You know, it's like, there's a lot going on there. She is obsessed with us, Sir Austin. I agree. She's at a bird sanctuary. Clearly, we're on her mind. She's thinking about the nest 24-7, obviously. Yes. Agree. Agree. She's out of shape everywhere. Why specify the bird sanctuary? <laughs> you know, maybe the, maybe the Hooked on Phonics. It was on her channel that I just got that ad. So maybe it's more about about her channel could be your theory is she gave him the couple's channel to try to support him while she's away that's possible that's very possible i mean they haven't uploaded anything there since thailand that was like august or september ish i swear she only went to that vegetarian buffet because her vegetarian aunt took oh definitely oh yeah Francis, when I saw that place was vegetarian, I already had an idea that she was with Uncle Phil, but like that vegetarian restaurant, I'm like, oh, definitely, definitely Uncle Phil. Mm hmm. Uncle Phil seems fun, actually, in a way, you know, like bearable. The alleged English major needs to go back to basics, BB. Yes, agree. Okay, it's only 13 minutes long. Let's get into that. Oh, she looks terrible. She looks bad. No surprise, right? All right. Here we are. Foodie beauty. Okay, Chantal. <laughs> hey, guys. Just a shameless cameo plug here. Get your cameo today and don't delay. Very shameless. Video just coming. She doesn't look good at all. She's sweaty. I mean, we talked about the undercaps, right? Like the undercaps, okay? The undercaps, Chantal. They're very cheap. When she was buying some before she left, I was telling you guys how like you can get them for like two or three dollars. There's no reason to have undercaps that are all worn out like this. Like it has like the little pills. Ugh. And the off-white just does not work. It just doesn't, no. In your way. Now. Is that my e jewelry? Sure. I like hey guys, that. Today. Okay, terrain decamping. We're at Le Parc. I don't speak a lick of French. 
um, Parks of the St. Lawrence, Sanctuary, something, Migrating Birds. Oh, it's in English. <laughs> it's in English right below it. Okay. Upper Canada <laughs> Migratory Bird Sanctuary Campground. Okay. And this is Camp Kagama. All right. Let's do it. <laughs> we are going to enjoy some nature at the Upper Canada Migratory Bird Sanctuary Campground in Ingleside, Ontario. So Yella, let's go enjoy some nature and see what we can find on this beautiful spring day in Canada. Welcome, welcome. There's a deer. Wow. Wow. Hi. Subhanallah. Oh my goodness. Oh, there's more. Hi. <laughs> Who's filming? <gasps> okay, okay, Chantal. Okay. I mean, she's from Canada. Doesn't she see deer, like, often? Isn't this, like, why it, I don't know, maybe she just hasn't in a while? I don't know. But, okay, so she's saying subhanAllah, which means praise God. Wow. Hi. <gasps> subhanAllah. Hi. Hi, oh dear. Hi. 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 Hi, dear. <gasps> There's many different walking trails here. Oh, shoot. This is sped up because I had um, what's his name's video set up to go faster because I didn't want to have to go through, you know, an hour of Salah. <laughs> okay. Great place to come just for a walk in nature you know i've lived here my whole life right and never realized how gorgeous the nature is like it's like i'm seeing it all for the first time or something no it's it's really beautiful you know i'm really enjoying myself alone out here honestly i love it Yeah. It's gorgeous. Let me guess. I'm staying in Canada. I'm staying. How could I leave my home? And you know what? It's cliche, but life is so much more fulfilling when you appreciate the really small things like that. Oh my god. I know. I need a <sighs> manicure bad. Really? You bite your nails, Chantal. What? What? What is this already? We're all over the place already. Already. Oh, we're getting life coach Chantal. Appreciate the small things. Blah, blah, blah. I need a manicure. You bite your nails. Oh, yeah. go get one then. I'm going to get my nails manicured. You but... should do something. Uh, no color. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna wear, I'm just gonna get like the cuticles removed, nails trimmed, stuff like that, cleaned up. Nice and clean. <laughs> BB, that's true. I don't even realize that that's a trigger for the bad manicures. I know, don't get AOIS started on the manicure. Man, Amber Lynn Reed and her dang black nail polish, like either either have it not chipped or just take it off completely and put on a neutral color. Oh my god. I know. I don't know why. It's, well, I'm always looking at my nails to make sure they look good. Like, I mean, I don't know. Okay. You're right. It is it is a thing. <laughs> All right, now to go over here. Going to the bench. You should take a rest, Chantal. Yeah, let's 
have a seat at the swamp. Sit down at the swamp and, and let's just have a chat about life and stuff. Let's do that. Let's do that. She's so boring, says Evelyn. She wants that money that's... Uh, Canada is beautiful today. Tomorrow it will be something else and driving high. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. She's, if anything, I mean, she's inconsistent. Yeah. Of course, she's not going to explain what was written on the bench. That's right, Boys and Betty Four. Yeah, just donated by this and that person. Whatever. You know, I was just thinking, like, mm -hmm. it's windbreaker season. But, like, is it just me? Or I remember windbreakers, like making the wind colder against your body because like they kind of stick to your body when the wind hits them i don't know that's because you're sweating chantal that happens when you're sweating underneath your windbreaker so that, i mean that's why you'd get colder yeah sweat anyone else crickets no okay <laughs> you're sweaty that's why Right, dying duck fit. Lots of mosquitoes Ooh. when it warms up. Oh yeah. Mhm. Mm I'm loving this day. <laughs> she's high AF, Patricia. <laughs> oh, she's another nice pond AF. here. Oh. Hop in. Let's see how the water is. Bird houses everywhere. Bird houses. Show us one. <sighs> this trail goes in like a circle. Mm -hmm. Back to my car. <laughs> oh. How far is it? It's a big nature reserve. Mm -hmm. It's probably a quarter of an acre. And there's the St. Lawrence River, I believe. Oh, yeah, you're probably right. Crystal Cat says, yeah, yeah, I finally got a notification before the stream. YouTube seems to be fixed. Oh, please don't jinx it. <laughs> Thanks for the live, even though her swamp content is boring AF. It is, Crystal Cat. And thank you so much for being a nasty bestie for four months. Thank you. I remember there being rumors as kids that there's bodies in the river. Surely there are. Why does she have to take it there? Why Why are we going there? There's bodies in the river? Okay. okay. But who knows? Mm -hmm. Kind of morbid. <laughs> nice birdhouse. <laughs> She's calling the birds. Hi! I'm gonna take another break in memory of <sighs> then last step we'll be back to the car and I have actually I have an appointment <laughs> at 2 30 so yeah I know no one else understands my journey a few of you do but oh my god is this for real I thought we were going to see birds. No. Little Seven has been a nesty bestie for four months. Didn't she promise us more hill rolling recently? She did. She did. It was on her banner for her channel, and then she removed it. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. I, I haven't seen any hill rolling. I haven't seen anything fun. I've just seen this 70-year-old woman huffing and puffing, trying to move along, bird watching, but not showing us any birds. So, yeah. Or maybe those who do don't really say much. <laughs> but that's okay, you don't have to. My life to live, you know? <laughs> Anyways, thanks for being here. Little birdhouses around here. Why don't you peek in one? Show us some birds. <laughs> Mrs. Jones, did I miss it? <laughs> I think we're there. I don't know. <laughs> Show us something. This is closed. But... Oh, go in. What is that? <gasps> Your taxidermy thing is oh, going on they're here. they're not alive. <laughs> Of course, that's typical, Chantal. That's very typical. Oh, I'm at a bird sanctuary. Oh, could, maybe we could see, like, you know, some owls or eagles or some kind of majestic bird. Like, maybe with a healing wing. You know, like, maybe it got an injury and, like, it's healing. You know, that's what I picture, like, with a sanctuary. Like, you know, let's keep you safe, little guy. Come on in, you know. 
But no, she shows us dead animals. Of course, it's typical, Chantal. Typical. Get the mystery has been a nasty bestie for three months. Love it. Love it. Thank you so much for being a nasty bestie for three months. Fantastic. The music observations. doesn't match the video, but it never does. Hi, guys. Hi. Welcome back to another vlog. Oh, I'm thanks. here at the bird sanctuary uh, in Ingleside, Ontario. So, yeah, I saw some cute deer already. It was so nice, and it's so peaceful out here. There's, like, no one around. So I'm just going to see what I can see and do a bit of exercise. Yella different places you can oh. look out here. She can start doing squats or something. Patricia Ingalls has been a nesty bestie for four months. Thank you, AYSN nesties. Patricia, thanks for supporting the channel as much as you do. It's really appreciated. Thank you. Artemida, or Artemida, I'm sorry, I forget. Hi, everyone. Just wanted to say that your hairy video was hilarious, AYS. Thank you so much. I'm glad you enjoyed it. We got to We got to stick up for Harry. She's not going to. She forgot about him. Might be out of breath. What was that? They're bats, Chantal. Duck. You better duck. Oh, Ooh, what's the sign? Stay I away. <laughs> oh my god. No one out. So my owl's covering it, but it says I have a fear of Bigfoot. She has a fear of giant squid in the sea. She has a fear of Bigfoot. Chantal, I can tell you that Bigfoot, they're not out and about during the day like this, okay? They're not. They're not. Justice for Harry, exactly, Oceana Song. Save Private Harry. Here. So, yeah, I'll be out of breath because, well, I'm overweight and I have asthma, so... You don't have asthma. At this point, you probably have COPD or emphysema or something. You don't have asthma anymore. No. No. I don't buy it. Yes. Kind of windy, though. Chilly. Hello, geese. A lot of geese this time of year. chipmunk oh my god <laughs> hi hi Let's see if i can zoom in more yeah harass a chipmunk oh my god look oh, at this <laughs> look at this filmography <laughs> a bunch of dead branches i feel like we could take this and we could see things in it like we could take a screenshot of this and find stuff in it i mean personally let me see i don't know if you can see my cursor no, you can't. So, like, sort of in the middle, a little bit to the left, it kind of looks like a skull to me. That looks like a little skull. Let me enlarge. <laughs> like, let me take a picture. Let me zoom in on these dry, dead branches. Oh, look at the chipmunk. Oh, I, I don't see it. I don't see it. I'm confused, says Thunder Rain. 666, number 31 on the list, has been up an owlet for three months. Thank you. I'm confused. Why so many birds lately? What do you mean? For Chantal? Has she been doing a lot of birds lately? Or are you, talk, or are you new to my channel? Because we're all about the birds. Onyx831 has gifted one Are You Serious membership. Thank you, Onyx831. Thank you. <laughs> Shelly Daly received it. Awesome. 
awesome. Welcome, Shelly. Welcome back, Shelly. And thank you so much, Onyx. Appreciate that. A small foot. <laughs> Not a big foot, but a small foot. <laughs> I mean, who knows? With her scent, she might really, you know, get some stuff to come out of the woods and come see her. Take this footage and play horror music over it. That would be fantastic. That would really fit. It would. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's terrible quality. <laughs> well, you know, you are editing the video, so you could cut it out, but, you know. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, guys. So I'm just mm -hmm. having a sit down here. Just it's a lot of resting, Chantal. There's a lot of resting. Yes, you guys. Oh, my God. I got to get some pictures together. I definitely want to bring that on stream. Alexis has been sending me these hilarious pictures, and they're real owls. I mean, hilarious. Like, I'll be at work, and I'll open it up, and I'll be like, ah! unbelievable. Owls have, like, all these different, like, postures. So... <laughs> <laughs> Did you know owls can sit cross-legged? Now you know, says Alexis. Yeah, and baby owls, the way they lay, they lay down on their tummies. Oh my God, I've never seen anything like it. It's, I gotta, I'm definitely gonna put some pictures together and bring it on stream because it's, it's the cutest thing you can imagine. To soak up a bit of sunshine, vitamin D, <laughs> and yeah, there's all geese around. So I'm just hanging out with the geese <laughs> and it's really gorgeous. It's, it's a really gorgeous day. Like the sky is blue, you know, there's no rain. It's not too hot, which is how I like it. So, yeah, you know, it's not that comfortable in Kuwait, Chantal, by the way, let's check, uh, let's check the Kuwait weather right now. Let's take a look. Have you ever seen an owl after anesthesia? No, I haven't, Emily B., but I'd like to. Okay, weather for Kuwait City. Conditions are fair with a temperature of 75 degrees Fahrenheit, 24 degrees Celsius. And that's at like 2 in the morning. It's like 2.30 in the morning there right now. The wind is blowing from the south at 5 miles per hour or 8 kilometers per hour. And the current humidity is 54%. So enjoy the nice weather, Chantal, 75, and you'll be burning up. Thunder rain, you meant foodie? Okay. First, then nesting geese. Oh, then seagull. That's true. I never, I didn't even notice that thunder rain, the, uh, the trend with the birds. I didn't even notice. You're right. You're right. Uh, and now this bird sanctuary, maybe I'm overthinking it, but this seems to be a theme. Do you think she's trying to bust into the nest? Uh, is that what's happening here? Oh, you better not be, Chantal. Thank you, Kaibella. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. You better not be, Chantal. You're not welcome in the nest. No, I mean, I tried to be nice to you. I did, but you've been a jerk right back to me. So good point, Thunder Rain. I didn't even notice that. Didn't even pick up on that. Mm -mm -mm. I'm in her head, little seven. That could be. That's a possibility. Yeah. Yeah, but it's a bit <laughs> cool. <laughs> So I guess I'm kind of like surprised how quickly you can lose your stamina for um, exercise. And, yeah. you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if you sit on a floor for eight to ten months straight and order in delivery, very high calorie family size meals and sit on the floor and eat them every single day yeah you're gonna lose quote unquote stamina stamina yeah you will you're gonna be out of breath you're gonna feel out of shape yeah you haven't moved period you haven't moved at all not at all what's this angle lilis i think she's trying something new it's very um she thinks it's creative i guess but really we can just see how her eyeliner has already rubbed off so what happened to your unicity, says Mega Omega? Yeah, I mean, that would give her some energy. I just, um, yeah, I'm just like not in the best of shape. <laughs> and especially just today, I'm feeling, um, you know, just a bit tired and um, like I can't walk too, too much. So 
I am just going to enjoy nature and do a little bit as I can and, you know, just take it day by day beyond that, try to walk a little bit every day. But I definitely want to bring up my stamina for um, exercise. It really bothers me that I can't walk very far without being uncomfortable. And I know there's a great deal of discomfort I'm going to be going through for the next while. So I'm bracing myself for that. Why but... is that? Why? Why? Why is that? Look at the hand. I don't usually comment on her hand, but it does look extra, extra swollen right now. Extra swollen. Keto Couch Potato, welcome back to being a nasty bestie. Welcome back. Yeah. Welcome back, Kato. Not in the best of shape, says Dirt Merchant. Understated as always. Yeah, I mean, at least she doesn't exaggerate, right? I'm a, I just, I'm a little low on stamina. You know, I can only walk for five miles. I used to be able to walk 10, but yeah, I just need to build it up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Even if it is uncomfortable getting mm -hmm. out here, it is mm -hmm. important for me to yeah. bring my physical, you know, my um, physical abil abilities out of the trash that they're in right now seriously you know and I realize also that means eating healthy so that's something else that I'm going to continue to uh, mm -hmm. try and really um, <laughs> you're going to continue to what you're going to continue to what Chantal <laughs> I gotta eat healthier I got to I got to continue to ignore the signs my body's giving me that it really can't take it anymore. Can't continue to do this. Can't 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 hate pink stars. How's it going? You two Onyx have a great dinner. Yeah. Bodybuilder arc incoming looking forward to the six pack abs. Well, she did ask us if that was like a realistic goal. Am I crazy? Or do you guys think I could get six pack abs? Um, you're crazy. You are crazy. Yeah. Just eat healthier and a lot less, a lot less. So we'll see how that, how this journey goes again. <laughs> but, um, hi, mm -hmm. hi, hi. Yeah. Hi. Hey, Snuggle Puss. I'm having a pretty good week. Thank you for asking. I hope you are as well. Yeah. Oh, you're welcome, Willis. I gifted five at the beginning of the stream. You are quite welcome. Six beanbag abs, maybe. That's uh, I like that. Never. Imagine that, AI. Oh, beanbags. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Big Turks and Quick Turks. What you doing? What kind of bird is this? Oh, do we have any bird watchers in the house? In the nest? <laughs> any bird watchers in the nest? What kind of bird is this? That's a little cutie. Hey, what you doing, cutie birdie? Big Turks and Quick tw <laughs> I haven't seen you at every stream as we used to, Big Turks and Quick Twerks. So I'm not, I remember how I used to stumble over your name all the time and then I got it well now I'm stumbling again so you're gonna have to come around more often and big turks and quick twerks gifted one are you serious membership yeah <laughs> Awesome, awesome. And otters and elephants received it. Awesome. And guys, if you if your membership runs out and you're not able to renew it, don't worry about it. Just keep coming in and chatting. I don't keep track of anything like that, okay? Just keep coming in because you might get you might get gifted one because they're being gifted constantly. So don't worry about it. AYS is quick twerk. Stamina is low from lack of practice. Listen, you know nothing about my twerking stamina. It's very modest, okay? But the stamina is high, very high. This is a chickadee, everybody. Okay, nice. Little chickadee. Oh my gosh, I'm like Snow White. 
Hi. Hi. Oh my god. <laughs> this bird comes to me when I call it. Hello. Oh my god. Okay, it is so worth it to come out here and just spend some time. There's so much nature and animals. That's so cute. I was going like and this these birds just kept coming to me. I'm Snow White, I know it. I know you. I walked with you once upon a dream. <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys look at this. Does anyone know what kind of birds they are? They're really small. So, so. Listen, come to the nest and the nest will tell you what kind of, I mean, they were like 30 people saying chickadee. Chantal, I know you're bird obsessed right now for some reason. I didn't even realize that, but apparently you are. And I think it's because you've been in the nest lurking, but probably not twerking. Let's be, I mean, I don't want to assume, but I, I would say since you don't have much stamina to even walk, you're probably, your twerking skills are probably not really up to par. I am, uh, that's just an assumption, but I think it's a pretty safe one to make. Francis, you got gifted one the day your your membership ran out, so it was nice. That's what I'm saying. Just like, you know, don't be afraid to chat just because you're not in green. I truly, like, it doesn't matter. <laughs> Seriously, I don't keep track at all. It doesn't matter if you're coming in gray, green, blue, orange, whatever. It's cool. Black cap chickadee. Oh, Oceana song. You're extra detailed with your. Uh, okay. Good, good, good. Mm. She'll throw her back out, Rosebud, probably. She won't even try. She probably can't even, like, bend over enough to do it, you know? You know, they're just really small. Anyways, guys, thank you for listening to me talk. Um, just in a very, like, thoughtful mood today. So, and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. <laughs>thanks for the great vlog Chantal thanks for all of your effort yeah we saw like two birds that's right mm -hmm. we saw two that's right and a um a squirrel and a chipmunk mm -hmm. yep yep Mrs. Jones oh my goodness thank you so much for gifting five are you serious memberships thank you Mrs. Jones thank you <laughs>
Amber Lynn. They are fantastic. Fantastic. You th <laughs> Sir Austin, you thought Life and Vibe blocked you because <laughs> you were on her channel last night when you two broke. <laughs> yeah, people were having like trouble chatting. Subscriptions weren't loading. Like it was just a hot mess. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, uh, so Dank Fupa, I saw your, um, your, uh, like your survey poll thing. Like, do you want more Amberlynn or do you want Chantal? And people voted for Chantal. I really like your Amberlynn ones. I think they're, I, I just, I want to see what happens when Amberlynn goes overseas to meet her girlfriend. I want to see, unless, I, unless I've missed it. I don't think so. Woo. It was weird and slow and kept glitching M's. It really did. It was bad. Mm -hmm. It's where it's coming. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'll keep an eye on it for sure. You have to do a Bark Street Bless because you're having issues? Oh, okay. All right, Cat C. We need something with Harry blow blowing up golden poop. <gasps> Why did you retract that dying duck fit? Don't be ashamed. Don't be ashamed of your creativity. <laughs> Amberlynn in Paris. Yes. Amberlynn is trying to claim that she has a new girl. She's calling her Valentine. I don't buy it. I don't. Mm -mm. We need a swollen side of the face for Chantal in the next Dink Fupa video. <laughs> I mean, it's definitely, there's something going on there. Yep. So here we are in Operation Dessert Storm. We have the cake behind us. We have cupcakes falling out of the sky. Uh, we've got another tank with Harry riding very precariously on top of that tank. And we got a, a very determined looking owl coming right for us. Yeah. And Oceana Song just gifted five Are You Serious memberships. Thank you, Oceana Song. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much and it looks like joyful Danae received one dank fupa got a membership yeah clover face of america and oh hell no <laughs> i like that name got memberships and my goodness patricia ingles just give i mean are we turning everyone green up in here today it looks like we are patricia ingles just gifted five are you serious memberships thank you patricia thank you Awesome. And Jen received one. Dirt Merchant got one. Yeah. Operation Dessert Storm is uh is it comes from Dirt Merchant. They mentioned it the other day in the chat and I was like, oh my God, what a great idea. <laughs> Debbie Myers Brandt received one. Lindsay and Sweet Sea Monster. Thank you, Patricia. You're always helping the nest to go to, to go and to grow. <laughs> and I really appreciate it. Thank you. The nest is growing leaps and bounds. It's raining memberships. I mean, the nest is the best, Mrs. Jones. I totally agree. Everyone is so generous and kind, but like, we still have fun. We can still be snarky, but like, we're respectful of one of another. Yeah, because I mean, as we should be. Uh, where are the Lakmas? Oh, Lilis. You know, this is my dessert storm. <laughs> uh. Moz, man, this is how I ended up as a member of Pulpy's chat. Everyone was gifting and the chat was all green. I had to join. Moz, there's no pressure at all. Mega Omega, have a great rest of your day. Yeah, Dying Duck Fit, let's celebrate. Tap the like button. Yes, please do. Oh, yeah. Thank you, Patricia. So generous. And hey, M. Marcino, you love dessert, Ultimate Chaos? Yeah. I mean, you know, and if you're not a member yet, don't worry about it. Okay. You still have the commands to use through Nightbot. So you still have fun stuff to use. Oh, 
Did I spell it right? Yeah. So <laughs> Nightbot is going to give a list of commands. There it is in the chat right now. Exclamation and the word after it. There are no spaces. And you can play around with stuff and have fun in the chat too. So don't worry about it. We twerk modestly and quickly. Yes. And quickly. And you have to have stamina to twerk quickly. You do. I mean, let's be real. Eight little paws. You got off work an hour early? Yeah. Awesome. Right on time, looks like. Yes. Okay. So we have Salah. Okay. He did a live stream all by his all by himself. He had the support of Chantal in the chat, just like what they did in New, or in New Orleans. <laughs> Fatty to fat. <laughs> I looked up and saw Fatty to Fed and I said, New Orleans, Thailand, Fatty to Fed. Oh my goodness. Just gifted five. Are you serious? Memberships. Thank you, Fatty to Fed. Thank you. Well, dang, it's a party up in here tonight. My goodness, that's awesome. Thank you, Fatty to Fed. Jen got one, Chauncey. Alexis got one. See, see, Sapphire and Chat Baby. Welcome. Welcome. I love it here too, Jesse Rose. Thank you. <laughs> and if you are a brand new member and you haven't seen it yet, please check out your welcome video. It's a short little cute thing, but it's to officially welcome you to the channel. Now you can use the golden poop emoji for Salah stream. Yes. New members, check out your emojis. That's probably one of the biggest perks for sure. We work on them together as a nest and you guys tell me what, what you want to see and we, uh, we come up with it. Yeah. Make room for me. No problem, Citizen Cardigan. Get in here, you and your cardigan. <laughs> hey, Stones of the Past, how's it going? I love how many nurses we have in here, too. It's fantastic when Chantal starts her healthcare BS. Mm -hmm. It's very helpful, indeed. Harry in the tank. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, Elaine, you have to check out the emojis. Check them out. They were very carefully selected and done. Now, this is one of my favorites on the screen right now. This is a very um excitable owl real like uh, that's a war cry that's a legit war cry and we're right in the middle of operation desert storm right there oh just jamie oh my god <laughs> you guys what are you doing ah, gifted 10 are you serious memberships just jamie thank you oh my goodness thank you my goodness oh oh my are you kidding me <laughs> you guys <laughs> so uh, just jamie gifted memberships to aluminum brain citizen cardigan art Ar artemita artemita eight little paws got one and alex nixon tracy carol baker coffee maker that's a good name Cheekbones got one. Hey, Cheekbones. How's it going? Lurking and you've been outed. You have been outed. Cheekbones, welcome. Welcome. Cheekbones is a registered dietitian, I believe. Please correct me if I'm mistaken. Nancy McCoy got one. Yeah. Fantastic. Woohoo! And Sir Oz, are you kidding me, you guys? Are you serious? Are you serious right now? Sir Austin just gifted five are you serious memberships oh my goodness we're gonna do the welcome members whoa oh 
unbelievable. Sir Austin, thank you. You're so generous. Thank you. Living by Faith received a membership from Sir Austin, as did GK, Paraic, Militia Bunny, and Run Emmy Run. Wonderful. Looks very decadent yet intense. Oh, yeah. It's just like, what is even going on in this in this picture? Like, I don't know if you can even see Harry atop that tank on the left side. And we got all kinds of stuff falling out of the sky. And then this owl doing its war cry. And it's like, what on? This is truly chaos. Desert storm. <laughs> I love it. And Tony D. Oh, my gosh. Tony D. Just gifted five. Are you serious? Memberships. Thank you so much, Tony D. Thank you. <laughs> Unbelievable. And Tony D gifted memberships to M. Mac Attack. Uh, nothing but trouble. Geezer Monkey, Sally Jones, bedazzling art with Michaela. Everybody's getting outed. Hey, if you're lurking and if you're hate watching, you might want to dip out because you're probably going to be outed pretty soon. Just saying. I'm just giving you a heads up as a courtesy to you. Okay. All right. Oh. No problem, Rosie Posey. Please don't worry about it. Don't feel a need to explain yourself. If you remain gray, it truly doesn't matter to me. I'm just glad that you're here, for real. For real. Chantal has a new sock account, something like Beetle Beezer. Oh, that's Charles Reed. <laughs> that is Mr. Reed. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What? Cripwalk music? <laughs> I didn't even realize that when I made that I <laughs> here's something embarrassing I'm going to tell you about myself I love cripwalk I love to watch people cripwalk <laughs> okay I don't have I'm not in a gang I don't have a gang affiliation okay I don't I don't even know which one I would choose if I were to join a gang <laughs> at my age right I think I'm in the nest gang, but crip walking, there are some, there are some really good, there are some good crip walkers out there. So I'm always hearing that kind of song, that kind of like beat. So I must have chosen that song. Like, what? <laughs> And I didn't even realize it at the time. Too funny. Lime Jello has been an outlet for a month. You're eating your free, your favorite green jiggly dessert. Yum. Awesome. Lime Jello. Welcome. And Pony Upify, oh my god. Pony Upify, what is going on in here? Pony Upify just gifted five Are You Serious memberships. And Patricia, on, oh my god, oh my god. This is nuts. Oh my god, you guys are crazy. What are you doing in this nest? Crazy. I can't even keep up. I can't even keep up. Let's see. Pony Upify. Okay, Pony Upify gifted five memberships. UH got one. Jason C got one. Aunt Katie C. Morton. And one, two, three, four. Or maybe Shannon got one from Pony Epify and Patricia just gifted another five memberships. Ray's day to day vlogs got one. The Meepstis, oh, KM, Human Jerky, and Kirsten Cody. Wonderful, you guys. Oh my God. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much, everybody. I don't even know what to say. I mean, you know, I want the nest to grow, obviously, but it's like, it's so, it really, it's like, it, 
like it kind of I don't want to be corny but like it's kind of touching that like you guys want the nest to grow as much as I do it's like so nice (laughs) and Nightbot will be putting a link to your welcome video if you are a brand new member welcome 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 at least prismo we don't cook frozen food in the air fryer at least i mean at least we can say that we don't do that at least let's get some air fryers in the chat new members at least we don't use the air fryer for frozen food always at least why would i be jealous of salah why for what i jealous from salah at least when he come eat the food she cook, not I buy from the restaurant always. Mm-hmm. At least mm-hmm. we don't use the air fryer for frozen food always. Exactly, exactly. At least, at least, I agree. My goodness. No more naked owls? I don't think I've seen a naked owl. I don't know if I want to. It might be a little too, like, traumatizing, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. Big Turks and Quick Twerks just gifted another set of memberships five are you serious memberships my god big turks and quick twerks thank you so so much thank you goodness unbelievable thank you manitoba fats received one yup yup got one no me digas no me digas squish squish and espresso received memberships from big turks and quick twerks thank you thank you thank you oh thank you kimmer i appreciate that thank you mrs chester yeah if you're normally a lurker you might want to chat. Even if you don't know what to say, you can just put emojis in the chat. You can type LOL. Then YouTube, like they give them out randomly and they give them according, it says, I don't know, but it says like according to participation. So if you watch the videos, if you chat, if you leave comments, that type of thing, they're not too specific about how that works, but I know if you're chatting, it does help for sure. Thank you guys. Oh my goodness. Thank you. Uh, Rosie Posey, your boss joked that all her managers should do a crip walk. Oh, is your is your boss a crip? <laughs> yeah. So so if you're if you you know maybe you don't live in the states or you're not you know you know I happen to have the New York City gang manual. Okay, I just I just have it. Like it's in digital form. We can look at it someday if you'd like to, but. So the Crips, okay, are a gang, just like the Bloods, okay? They're like rival gangs, all right? And as I said, I don't claim any affiliation. I'm not in a gang. I've never been in a gang. I don't even know anyone personally in real life who's in a gang, okay? But <laughs> but the Crips, they have, a, they have this little dance that they do. I shouldn't say it like that. But they have this, like, this badass dance that they do, and it's called a Crip Walk. So if, you've, if you saw the Super Bowl last year, I think um, Snoop Dogg and Dr. Dre, they're Crips. So they were Cripping. They were Cripping like in the middle of the Super Bowl and they were wearing blue. Their color is blue. So, yeah. All are welcome in the nest. That's right, Lisa. I'm in an, <laughs> I am in an owl gang. That's true. But we're not organized. You know, I don't need any Rico charges over here. We're not an organized gang. We just kind of do our own thing. <laughs> Chantal got one on another channel, Carly Sue. Oh, that's funny. Outed. Outed. Great. <laughs> okay. All right. Let's get into Sultan Salah and his um his walk. He went on a walk. That's really all I can say. Now, at very at the very first, okay, he had been streaming for three minutes. So I just got on real quick and set it up. So you're going to see just the screen. It's kind of lopsided for now, but just give me a moment. It does straighten out where we can read the chat and everything. And I think the chat is going to be the most entertaining part of this. And he is just kind of walking along the streets. 
So I'll probably make the chat side a little larger so we can really focus on that. Okay. Here we oh, go. and I do need to speed it up because, you know, because, you know, it's Salah. 1.5 might be a little too fast, so I'm going to bump it down. 1.4. We'll try that and see how it goes. That's your dream. Hi. Hello, Char. Hello, Mark. Uh, can you hear me very well, guys? We can hear you, Salah. Good morning from your time, but uh, good evening from my time here. <laughs> good evening. Good evening. Thank you, Just Jamie. I appreciate you being here. This is his perp walk, Mrs. Chester. Uh, the time now, wait, let me check. Okay, let's check. It's uh, 5.55. 5.55 p.m. in Kuwait, and he's all over the place. You said woof woof in chat, but you're not sure if you're blocked. Well, we'll find out. So the chat does come up on the screen shortly. Yeah, check out your emojis. Here we go. All right. Let me do some fancy work hey, the last here. Mama Buns Cafe. <laughs> Mama Buns? Hmm. Hmm. <clears throat> still adjusting the kind ones so be kind guys be kind and they will make a shop for you oh yeah <laughs> people were really insulting Chantal in this so he's saying be kind be kind yeah, so Stuff K said was all up in there. Chantal, you have to hurry home. Salah is resorting to searching the streets for someone's farts to sniff. <laughs> so I screen recorded it in real time. So we, I mean, we get to see everything before they deleted it. Everything. And she was on it. She was blocking everybody right and left, left and right, up and down. So I just want to see if, we, if there's anything else. Someone's asking about HR immigration. Okay. Mm, YT Lover said, Salat, do you feel safe in Kuwait right now? Are you getting safety alerts from the government? Middle East is brewing right now. God bless and keep yourself safe. Foodie Beauty says, is it hot, babe? Babe. 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 Uh, have you pooped? Oh, Nanya says... Have you pooped on anyone while Chantal is away? No BS says, how's your mistress? I mean, people were like right out of it. I mean, at when I found him, he had been streaming for three minutes. So this like was starting right, I mean, right at the very beginning. Okay. And then Cynthia A says, Chantal, do you need a mod here? I can help if you'd like. Looks like you might need a mod. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Hello, Teodoro. Oh, she modded her. She said, yes, sure, Cynthia. Wow. You don't even know who Cynthia is, Chantal. I haven't seen this person, Cynthia, in your chat before. I mean, that's pretty brave. You don't know who Cynthia is. It could be Kybella. It could be. I love you, Shanta. I can't feed the chat, guys. Wait, let me arrive at the beach. Naoki, Naoki, welcome to the nest. Nike Pro Jack is Miriam there in Kuwait. Okay, wait, wait. No, I'm in Canada. Now she's under the couples channel, Salah and Chantal. This was streamed on the couples channel. <laughs> and 
the title said something like that this was during rush hour. This is not rush hour. Here we go. Okay, here we go. Now what, Salah? Where are you taking us? Don't be weird. Salah. Sorry, it looks hot there. <laughs> yes. It doesn't look hot. Jing Dalagan, welcome to Nesty Bestie. Welcome. And now it's going to be busy here because it's uh, here in the Middle East, mm -hmm. in the Gulf. Mm -hmm. People go out uh, after 5 p.m. That's true. Boston Bridget, Salah, I don't believe this is you. Show your face. Oh, show your face, Salah. Salah, I don't believe this is you. Show your face. <laughs> no need to believe. It's no problem, <laughs> Patricia. It's okay. I do sacrifice a lot, mainly my mental health. <laughs> following Chantal. <laughs> oh, so so, here. Did Salah have to give the Timu mobile back? Maybe. Sock bees or what year? I think the summer born? has been started here. Yes. Rainy days are nice too sometimes. Yes, babe. Exactly. Mm -hmm. You need a gimbal. I love raining. Salah, you need a gimbal. Bad. This herky jerky type of movement isn't working. Sorry. It's just not. Let's see that. Let's see that ish eating nice grin, one, Salah. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> exactly, Rosie Posey. Get a gimbal, Salah. It's supposed to be professional. Chantal unblocked on your main channel. Don't know why. Please unblock. She won't. Walking in silence in a parking lot. It's good content as usual. Great. Sir Circus Catasola told you Hello he had guys, a gimbal the during the Thailand beast. Let me take you to the basketball here. People hmm. playing. Where There's is also it? A volleyball as well. Volleyball. Okay. Mm -hmm. Great to see you back on YouTube. Is it? Ugh, please. Please. Bambas and candy. Thank you. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you. <clears throat> thank you for your kindness. Hey, Lulu. Welcome, guys. Welcome. Okay, Artemida. Have a wonderful evening. Thank you. Mabella, there are actually people in Kuwait. Why do we never see Touching them us. when Chantal is around? <laughs> people having fun here. Enjoying playing. Sock bees there, Salah. Why don't you want to live in Canada? <laughs> Hello, King and Queen Beezer. Hello, uh, Post Champ. Where should I go? This Join is them. odd. He doesn't have Maybe like a destination. Time. Just walking randomly. Why are we doing this? So that's how uh, the Kuwait beaches are busy. Kuwait beaches are busy. At this time, exactly. Mm -hmm. Salah, are you scared of war? The volleyball. Why are the beach is never this full when Chantal goes? Hmm. Oh, maybe the power's out in the fart box dirt merchant. That's possible. Mambella, I don't see anyone in an abaya. Is it old fashioned? <laughs> yes, babe. We go at non-busy times, yeah. <laughs> it's not old-fashioned, but... We go where the cats are. <laughs> I can tell you I've never worn one. Never. It's nothing... I mean, I've known people who do. Hey, Lavi. Cool, thank you. But in general, it's... Uh, it can be a, a, a couple of different types of women who do. And not like in a negative way. But that's right, you don't see a lot of abayas out there. 
people wearing Western clothing because, you know, that's what it's like there. Can't wait to see you guys desert camp this summer. Sure, sure. Not seeing the huge obesity problem, Katzi? Oh, yeah. It's the most obese country in so the world. Cool, it? No, it's not. No, it's not. Can you guys see the chat okay? Or do you want me to make it a little bit bigger? Then you won't be able to really see where he's walking. But let me change out my owl here for something a little less obtrusive. Jeweled owl, you've been great. Been a little distracting. Okay, so guys, uh, I hope all be kind and respectful. Ah, be kind and respectful. Why are you saying that? Uh, Mabella calling out the huffing and puffing, Tehansita? I didn't see it. It's like the chat is constant, making all kinds of comments. Constant. You can see it, Elaine? Okay, thank you. It's almost uh, sunset. Oh, it's so nice to watch a walking stream without the constant huffing and puffing. <laughs> <clears throat> oh guys if you want to opt in to receive a gifted membership nightbot is putting a link in the chat right now if you don't have a branded account okay which i don't know i do i have one so i can't receive gifted memberships um if you find like you're never getting them first you have to opt in to receive one if you just click on that link you'll be opted in but if it doesn't confirm with you that you want to opt in you might have a branded account and youtube doesn't allow gifted memberships on branded account i don't know i don't know the, the exact reason but yeah teardrop told marbella don't be rude <laughs> huffing and puffing will return shortly says chantal more stuff Kay said isn't it nice to be able to walk okay, further so than guys, 10 uh, feet all be kind and respectful be kind everybody we're here to just show you around mm -hmm. walking bees having fun don't be rude touching grass mm -hmm. touching grass no hits <laughs> more stuff Kay said better clean up all that sperm everywhere before chantal gets home <laughs> oh my god <laughs> and don't like be rude to anybody okay yeah don't be rude Thank you for your kindness. Don't be rude about cleaning up the sofa. <clears throat> God. <laughs> Look at these two trees here. <laughs> and she's putting poop emojis in the chat. Oh, she just got taken out. Boom. It was, it was that fast. Like uh, going to each other's side. <laughs> and someone asked. Go, uh, more deep. Salah, the if. Beach. They wanted Chantal to be healthy. She says, I won't get healthy here. I'm about to eat Putin, LOL, JK. <laughs> you guys in the poop emojis. No, she's definitely not JK. That's right. Mm-hmm. But at least you go out and do things in Canada. In Kuwait, you just sit inside and eat. It's worse somehow. The last Nashi said. Oh, something just got deleted. And I totally... It's going so... Well, I do have it sped up. But I don't... You know. Okay. This is what was deleted. It says... Salah, you deserve a woman who can keep up with you. Not one who can't left her husband because of heat. You will find her passed away in the bed one morning. Salah, don't put yourself through that, bro. <laughs> and that person's name is Outspoken. Whoo, I guess. Wow. <laughs> Should I wake up with her dead next to you in bed? And look how fast it got deleted. Wow. Yeah, here it is right here. And then boom. Yep, gone. It's like she saw the dead part and she was like, uh uh. Beach ASMR. It's not ASMR. It's Relaxing here. Chat. That's what's fun about your stream. So Outstanding. 
the chat. The water looks like NAL's bath water after a four hour soak. No shells. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm. I'm just glad I was working from home today yeah. that I was able to record it in real time. Otherwise, playing it back, you won't see any of that stuff. Like after it's not live. So is this a hard launch of Scatman, Delulu? <laughs> Could be. Oh, very blunt, yeah. Water is so nice, yeah. <laughs> is the water warm? Let me check. Yeah, Clover, I wasn't sure what to think uh, when I saw. I got the yes, notification. It's warm, but it's more to cold. More to be cold, yeah. The couple's channel was live. I'm like, huh? I'm like, oh, look at this. Look at this. Swimming would be great for you, Chantal. Easy on the joints. I mean, Sansa Cooks has been telling that for that for years, but she doesn't listen, so. She says, yes, Jody. <laughs> She's tired of being lectured. Yeah, I know. People here are chilling. <laughs> Do whales ever beach themselves in Kuwait? Asks what guys Mandela. here? There's too many kind of uh, shells and uh, rocks here, stones. Oh, why don't you collect some, Salah? Twerk quickly, says Moon Goddess Tarot. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Sperm everywhere, says Sasha Morton. Look at this chat, it's yes, wild. Me. They are wilding out. Oh, it's still there. Teardrop, you better grab that one. Gone. Good job, Teardrop. God, she's busy, huh? <laughs> so what I have you been... I will eat. <laughs> I will bite you. <laughs> mm -hmm. You're so funny, Salah. Thriller Kid, so what have you been doing without your wife lately? Are there barracudas in the water? <laughs> God. Grog is in there. Okay, let me rest here. It would suck to be a foodie mod. Oh, yeah. And you think she does anything for them? Look at these guys. I seriously doubt it. What is that? Hmm, a shell? Explain, Salah. Tell us. Cool, eh? <laughs> yeah. Cool if we knew what it was. Is the water warm? Yes, it's warm, but it's more to cold. More it's to be cold. Warm, but more cold. Okay. Did Chantal say ooh to her own smell about the barracuda? Yeah, I think so. Mm -hmm. Show feet, says Mabella. Show yourself, Salah. Show feet. <laughs> Let's see the feet. I saw your ear. <laughs> he is super lame. Spooky Von Sweets. He really is. I mean, this is all he's got. He has no personality either. Neither of them do. It's weird. You spicy right it now, Chantal? <laughs> what is that supposed Thanks, to Dave. mean? I love those sounds. Yeah, it's relaxing to drop, right? Love also, documentary. I miss hearing your love. <laughs> oh my god. I miss you and your love. <laughs> yuk, 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 you spicy yuk. right now, Chantal? LOL. Hey, Cam uh, Campbell's. LOL? The octopus emoji, right? <laughs> There's an octopus here. <laughs> You're an octopus, okay? Love that. <laughs> hey, Mabel. <laughs> Do you know what spicy means a lot? Yeah, mm. the spicy on the food. 
Mm. What else does it mean, Salah? Do you know? The hot sauce. <laughs> the hot sauce? Mm. Oh, what happened? I could sit there for hours, but I'm terrified of deep waters, uh, so I would just be relaxing. Oh. oh. Terrified? I hope you can do it one day, teardrop. Loser! She is L O S E R. Loser. Loser! She is L O S E R. Thank you, Kabela. Hello, Brittany. What time is it in Kuwait? I think it's 6, yeah, it's 6 p.m. now. Resist. Discarded roses has the poop emojis. Oh, taken. Oh, Mo, tra Mo translates. Are you still friends with Murad and Allah? She posted on Twitter that she got blocked after asking this question. <laughs> I need to clip that. L O L. Yeah. <laughs> it's better than the laugh. Just say L O L. Salah. Are you still friends with Murad and Allah? She said she got blocked right after this. It is a harmless question, Jen. I agree. But Chantal doesn't like hey, translates. Hey, Joanne. You gotta run. Stay well. Stay safe. Salah. Thank you so much. Because she can translate. Hello, happy life. That's why. There she goes. Bye bye. So Mo Translates is a channel who um, she she translates Arabic. So any of the stuff like with Alat Murad, you know the guys in Kuwait, anything in Arabic with um what's his name um Nader also. She was able, to, she translated everything and put it on the screen in English. So Chantal hates Mo Translates because of that, basically. Basically. And she hates women and she hates anyone who can speak Arabic. So, you know, so she got blocked immediately. Nice, huh? Miranda Snyder has been an outlet for three months. OMG. That laugh makes me want to cut my ears off. <laughs> Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. It's not necessary. Delulu. It's just a core to me. He's goofy. What's a core? It's just a core to me. Oh, it's a, just occurred to you, maybe, that he's goofy? He is. He is. Thank you, Kabela. <laughs> Thank you, Delulu. Yes, he's, oh, he's very goofy. Absolutely. He's, yeah, he's a goof, for sure. Thank you. What a beautiful place. That's an insult to Goofy. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it's beautiful. Mm. We will resume couples videos. Mike asked, are the couples vlogs returning? We will resume couples videos, inshallah. Okay. I guess Jason C, you should see, you guys should see what the Arabic comment said in her chat about six months ago. It was nasty but fair. Oh, like with um, with what specific was it? Like the Unicity stuff or before that? Like, do you remember what what it was about? He's an X-rated goofy. Oh yeah, he is. Ugh. Mm. Hey Mike, very good question. Our couple's blogs returning. Yes, Mike. as soon as Chantal is hearing it, Chantal will stop again. Uh, to do a couple, uh, couple videos. So stay tuned. <laughs> Did anyone ask how he liked being home alone? Was it legendary? I'm sure it was. Yeah. Sure it still is. Legendary. Uh, Gold Tube, I finished the university before you. <laughs> since like eight, eight to nine years ago. Mm -hmm. Thanks God, Alhamdulillah. Mm -hmm. Please, couples videos. Happy life. Yes, please, couples video. I love, I love couples, couples video. videos. Thank Ugh. you, guys. Stop kissing. You like your dots. He wants to kiss yours, okay? You Smart and fun. Thank this. you, baby. Okay. What's your degree, if you don't mind me asking? I love traveling with you, babe. <laughs> Dear drop trolls. Never mind, never mind. They have no life, so it's okay. <laughs> Tara, he was live earlier we can handle it. on the couple's channel. I love traveling with you, babe. Yes, me too, honey. I can't wait to travel with you. Can't wait to travel. She has no I stamina. Being around there. Thanks she a lot. can't walk. You're welcome, uh, Kimbers. You're welcome. Handsomest man. Oh, God. What did you study while in university? I finished uh, business management. 
-hmm. four years. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Not four years ago. Uh, it's the college four years. It's like a mm -hmm. bachelor degree. Okay. Mabella Salah, have you met Shmi yet? Ooh, good question. Teardrop is a clown. She really is. Lavi, let them talk. Yes, let them talk. More trolls. More trolls? <laughs> Yeah, what happened to the Beezer spray business? Lady G, or oh, uh, Lady J, hi. Yeah, so I doesn't have a sense Some of humor. Some trolls are funny, yes. Like at all. Hey, Nancy, how's it going? Would you ever also go the, back the, for a master's degree? The hates uh, trolls. Just pick them out by blood them, easy, right? What does that mean? Girl Tube said, especially when you're on Lemon Z, right, Chantal? I don't know what that means. I'm not sure. <laughs> Teardrop probably has onset, early onset dementia. <laughs> she probably does. <laughs> she probably does. Oh, Lemon Z is the weed? Oh, thank you, Delulu. That's all being mean. We'll be picked out. Instantly. Thank you, Tara. Thank you, Alexis. Thank you, Vive. Revive. So people live over here. No lemon Z. Sad face. Oh, thank you, Sachi Bell. Thank you, Life Prismo. is too short to hate. Yeah, I hope the haters <laughs> will understand this. Yeah. Life is too short. Thank you, Aluminum Brain. Time goes fast. Does it? Hey, Tracy. Tracy's in the chat. Yeah. Can you hear the beach from your apartment? Uh, not really. Hmm. Mabella Salat, did you see Chantal bet f sent? Did you, did you see Chantal spent forty Canadian dollars of your money at the buffet? You need to change the pin. <laughs> oh my god! Change the pin. She's spending 40 bucks on a vegetarian buffet. <laughs> yeah, Clover, no one can ask any questions. That's right. Yeah, we're just supposed to be entertained by the water and Salah, I guess. What did you do, Fraid? Salah, you still going to the gym? Uh, eggs. Uh, what did you do for Eid, Salah? So after Ramadan finished, uh... We had to eat for three days, you know that. Uh, I just like celebrated with my family, with my friends. Yeah, my Bella's getting away. Visits and uh, She's getting away with a lot. Gathering, having fun, having conversations, chatting together. Who's your star crush? Uh, so yeah. oh, that's all. Good question. More shells. Is that the real reason? Just freezing today. Oh, she got taken out. Must have been. <laughs> she wrote ew. <laughs> she was deleted. <laughs> it's not my fault that that lasagna was heavy. Forty dollars of heavy lasagna. Awesome. Thank you, Bombas. Stay away from pasta Hello, and rice at a buffet. It's like meaningless carbs. I like the gaming strings. Hope to see them back also. But it is a vegetarian sure, place, so I don't know. Mabella says, write Salah and Chantal in the sand. And he does it. He does it. So when he gets down to start writing it, I'll I'll like bump out the chat so we can see it better. Good idea. Right. Wait. I hope he says Grace Kelly. <laughs> Some petty for her. Oh, here we go. Here we go. All right. Let me adjust. I mean, we need to see this in full, obviously. Here we go. You need to see everything here. Here we go. Sa. Sal. There's his name. Good job, Salah. And. C H A 
N T A L. Yay! Good job, Salah. Good job. Hey, Tucker and friends. Salah and Chantal. Salah and Chantal. Good. Nice job. Oh, look at the water. It's about to wear ice at all. Hey. Hey, naughty beach. <laughs> naughty beach. He's calling the beach naughty. Hey, Harley Quinn. How's it going? All right. Good job, Salah. That was your, uh, that was your duty, I guess. To make... Oh, he's writing more. Oops. Is he writing it again? Salah? You must have backed up a little bit. What is this? Salah and... Do it with an S. That would piss her off. Imagine if he spelled it with an S. She would okay. rage. No. Salah and Chantal. Very nice. Salah. Good job. Yay. Nice. How about that? Okay. Great. Good job. Mm -hmm. Now get your shovel and bucket and let's build a castle. Let's do this. You can hear the call to prayer in the background. Nice job, Salah. You earned your salary for this week. Because he did it on a live stream in front of everybody. That's what really matters. <laughs> full of sand, no. <laughs> oh no, full of sand. You dirty boy, you better go wash up. I need to wash my hands. Mm -hmm. Can I come here, please? More, more, more. What about a heart? Oh, says Girl Tube. Hey, Vanessa. Yes. <laughs> okay, good. No sunset, guys. You sp Thank Fupa. Thank Fupa's in the chat. You spelled it wrong. It's S H A N T A L L. <laughs> Dank Fupa! <laughs> but yeah, Kitty Connecticut, it's spelled out and A N D. Yep. Okay, sea life. We'll see you when you catch up. Careful what you wish for, says Is, the, water, is the water cool? Yes. It's warm, uh, but more to be cold. It's cool, but warm. Do you have a brand account? Hey, Gigi. Yeah. I know. I have one too, and I'm not even sure. Sunset, palm trees, oh, uh, the mosque here, and the beach behind me. I mean, it's good if you don't want to get outed. If it's you're kind of heaven, right? <laughs> nice but sunset. It stinks because you can't receive a gifted membership. Salah Beach Bees. <laughs> Naughty Beach sounded like something else, Bombas and Cindy. Yeah. Naughty Beach. Lisa P, uh, I believe it's uh, too many people here. <laughs> and there's only like one beach of like too many. Fish said, where there's are more. the ladies? Ooh, where are the ladies? I don't ladies? like to uh, film the, the people a lot, you know that? You should put Julie in a backpack. Mm. Teardrop, you're insane. Hello, Charles, Raid. Hi, Squeaky. Choose someone on the beach and have a race, squirrel tube. Great, yeah. <laughs> it's very nice, eh? Oh, boy. Cringe, 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 cringe. Chantal, it's paradise. You have to do more walks. It would be so, so good for your soul. She's like, yes, wind swept. Chantal, it's paradise. You have to do more walks. It would be so good for you. So, mm -hmm. yeah, uh, wind swept. I agree. Good for her stamina. <laughs> Inshallah, she will uh, do her best. Stamina. <laughs> Build your stamina. That's <laughs> but I have my cold water. It's enough. <sighs> You must be enjoy going. Oh, look at this. Look at this. So there's more to, what can I say? There's a, there's a name in this chat who is someone's real name, but it's not like someone's impersonating somebody in this chat. It says you must be enjoying going out in public without the 400 pound embarrassment. Oh, nice to nice nice that you are back. Thank you, Squeaky from. Hey, John Galt. Hey, 
I start to be sweaty. I've been walking for like 45 minutes. Have you ever considered putting a lock on the fridge? This is a big mosque in the background. Let me move it over so you can see. That's probably where the call to prayer was coming from. That's a big mosque. So those two tall things are called um, minarets. So back in the olden days, the muezzin, the person who does the call to prayer, who recites it, goes to the top of one of those minarets and does it very loudly so that everyone can hear. You know, back in the day, now they have like um, speakers. So, yeah. Um, Abella, have you ever considered putting a lock on the fridge? My friend Crystal's parents did that when they had a squatter <laughs> who wouldn't stop eating. She lost a lot of weight that way. Just a suggestion. Wow. Wow. So as far as the call to prayer goes, um, by the way, if you're new to my channel, hello, I'm a revert. I'm a Muslim revert. I lived in Egypt for a couple of years. I was Christian the entire time. I came back. Um... And it was uh, almost a year later, close to a year later, that I reverted to Islam. And I didn't do it for a man. I didn't do it because I was living in Egypt. I was in the States and I was single. So, uh, so that's a little bit of my background. So when we hear the call to prayer, it doesn't necessarily mean that you have to drop to the ground right then and there. There are, you have time between the call to prayer and the actual prayer starting. And if it's not convenient for you, if you're in the middle of something, you do have up, up until the next prayer time to get the prayer done. So I did see people kind of comparing when Chantal goes live and it's at a prayer time. She only goes live for like 90 minutes at the most. And there's more time than that in between prayers. So you'll see me online at certain times during during a prayer time. It's not that I'm not praying. It's that we have a, a time period of a couple of hours to get the prayer done. So no one's like dropping to their, you know, dropping to the ground as soon as they hear the call to prayer. There's like, you have to go and perform wudu to clean yourself before you have to prepare for the prayer. And yes, Megan, I was just showing the, the minarets of the mosque. I'll, I'll put it back in a sec. So yeah, so, you know, they definitely, they can be criticized for a lot of things, these people. But as far as praying, you know, like, that's not a criticism that anyone can really make in this case that I've seen. I've never seen, and I keep track of stuff in general, just in the back of my mind. And I've never seen them go completely from prayer to prayer and not stop doing something. So... I haven't seen them myself miss a prayer. Now, I don't know if they're praying or not, and it's none of my business. It truly isn't. It's not up to me to call them out. It's this is between themselves and their creator, just like my prayers are between myself and my creator. So it's not as strict as what people might think. And people have lives. People will miss prayers also. It happens. It happens. You can make them up, but... You know, it's definitely not something to, like, get too up in arms about. That is for sure. So, yeah, let me move it back over now. Especially where you guys may not have seen a mosque in the Middle East. And right during the call to prayer, that's what it looks like. Mosque. With the sunset in the background. Devil eggs, uh, Salah, are you going to be going live more often, doing gaming streams? I'll do my best. Look at the sidewalks here. <laughs> it's cute. Amy L says sperm everywhere, question mark. I mean, my goodness, my goodness. Yes, thank you, Fatty DeFed, for newbies. In this chat, we prefer not to criticize their religion. Trust us, there is plenty else to scrutinize. Welcome to the nest. Thank you, Fatty DeFed. That's excellent. Thank you so much. It's yeah, it's absolutely true. Yeah. And sometimes people will unintentionally insult a lot of Muslims when they're really just intending to insult Chantal. But it, it sometimes it gets a little out of hand and statements become very broad sweeping and it gets to be a little too much. There's plenty of things 
And especially if you're not Muslim, okay, I'm just saying, if you don't know a lot about the religion, you know, calling things out, it really doesn't reflect badly on Salah and Chantal, you know, just saying, just saying. But yeah, we don't, I mean, everyone is welcome here. Absolutely everybody. And we don't criticize each other for our beliefs. Sperm everywhere. <laughs> We do have a bunch of different beliefs here. Yes, all kinds of birds. All kinds. We don't hear Salah huffing and puffing. What's up with that? You're still with us, Salah? Should I go up, guys? I see what they have here. I agree, John Galt. Anyone who's putting American cheese on their burger or in their omelet is insane. <laughs> Truly. Truly. Swiss cheddar. It's like watching teller. <laughs> mm -hmm. I wouldn't Behind put yeah. blue cheese on a burger either. Some people are fishing here. If you can see on the right. Yeah, cheese yeah. choices middle, exactly. can be judged. The screen. Yes, always. <laughs> Canuck gal, I, Salah, I hear Windex is good for removing stains from sperm all over the place. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and we do have cheese loser, which is the best cheese of all, because when Salah says that, he says, uh, she's a loser. It sounds like he's saying cheese loser. So we have a cheese emoji with loser. Cheese yeah, loser. Loser. Cheese, L-O-S-E-R. Cheese, L-O-S-E-R. Ah, dink fupa. Salah, you and Teardrop would make a beautiful couple. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, Delulu, I will fight you for that. My God. American cheese. Are you sure? I love to fish, Tracy. <laughs> there's mm. some people. And there's too many people. And also, there will come more when it's uh, dark. Mm-hmm. <laughs> What kind, what kind of, of fish, fish are native there? Are uh, they native. have uh, here uh, hmm. hamur, an interesting question. Nwebi, Sbedi, Sbedi, uh, Ned. What else? Everybody cooks fish here. That's Flop. what I remember here. <laughs> There's also more. <laughs> Everybody cooks fish here. Flop. It's Kuwait. Chantal, I never, I never realized it was so pretty. Is that a shipwreck in the distance? Dragonfly vibes. That's beautiful, yeah. <laughs> Everybody cooks fish here. Flop. It's Kuwait. I will finish the one hour. Okay. Like, uh, there's, Everybody uh, cooks minutes fish more. here. Flop. It's Kuwait. Mm -hmm. Everybody cooks fish here. Flop. It's Kuwait. How dare you? Everybody eats fish mm -hmm. in Kuwait. <laughs> Can you walk more? <laughs> Rosie Posey, I didn't catch that when I was um, live recording how many people were in there. I'll but take you with me uh, to the way back to home. Alexis said earlier that maybe about 200 the temperature in were in there at the time. Uh, I think it's around 31 uh, Celsius. 30 or 31. But it will be cooler now. Oh, windswept. With everything that's going on in the world, I've been thinking about learning about Islam. Any tips, Chantal? After the sunset. Not more than 200 when you popped in? Okay, thanks, Jen. Any tips, Chantal? I can see why you love Kuwait, Chantal. <laughs> yes, happy life. Give us it's some beautiful. tips. Why has he never said he doesn't want to go to Canada? And also people are kind here. Nobody stalk you here. Oh, wow. Chantal. 
you know what? Okay, I have I can't be hypocritical because I have told her to stop talking about it because she constantly she doesn't care about giving out correct information or she really doesn't. She does not. So she says, when swept, there's a lot of info out there online. And I was about to criticize her for giving a cop out like, oh, don't talk to me. But I think she's I think this was the right thing to do in this case because she truly has no idea. Like none, none, no, no idea. Nobody harass you. Yeah. So that's OK. 199 uh, too many. <laughs> respectful, uh, low and people. Oh, kindness, <laughs> kindness and uh, respectful. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Respectful. Shuffle the water, hello. Look at the sea, how it's beautiful. <laughs> yeah, Chantal's tip don't get the Italian meatballs, they have pork in them. But she'd probably say, but if you don't know about it, if it doesn't say it on the menu, you know, ignorance is bliss. <laughs> so quiet compared to here in the States. Oh, nice. Which isn't true. Shant Whale, Nina just wrote. Deleted. <laughs> he was live for like an hour. Let's see, how far are we in? Oh, we're almost done. I love how some trolls, they love to be kicked out and be blocked. No, you do. <laughs> well, I swear, there's no life. <laughs> it's only like 10 minutes left. What are pathetic trolls? Maybe I'll start with the Quran, so maybe a beginner's... We'll for you guys. I mean, the haters. For dummies <laughs> or something? Sure. Yeah, there are many forms for beginners, windswept. It's wonderful here. Breathtaking. Yeah, too bad your wife wouldn't go for a nice evening stroll with you, Salah. That could be a very nice activity after dinner every night. Hello, cutie cat. Hi. Stay away from the cat. <laughs> Hi, how are you? Mm -mm -mm. Stay away from the cat. You're so cute. Yes, you are cute. I swear to God you are cute. He's a cat man now. <laughs> Yellow bye. See you later. Yellow bye. <laughs> <laughs> Mount Bella said, most of Foodie's walks are breathtaking, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Cat Daddy. <laughs> She's so cute. He's the best cat dad. Oh, okay. Go back, enjoy your new life, but please never lose your quirky, fun spark. Mm. I'm just old now. Chantal, you're 40. Oh, she's one of these people who has like a number in her head. Okay, when I'm this age, I'm gonna stop being myself and I'm just gonna like morph into this old lady. I mean, really, a lot of your age is like your mentality. She's like, she thinks she's an old lady now and she's gonna act like one and look like one. <clears throat> Look at the lights here. People playing here on the sand. They're playing football. Yeah. Yep, deviled eggs. Chantal, you can't use old as an excuse. There are many spunky and active older people in their 60s and 70s. That's right. That's right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, as little seven, she couldn't wait for 40 to give up. I mean, some people get they numbers spend a lot of money in their heads. Developing your beach, ours isn't, ours isn't very nice. Mm. Interesting like a milestone. Like, I want to be married by this age. I want to have two kids by this age. It's like, you have your plans, you know, God has his plans, you know, if you, you know, if you're a believer or, you know, or just karma, whatever, you know, whatever you believe. Windswept says, I have to say, even though I understand you deleting your old content, it was my comfort content and I miss it. Not the crazy live stream error, but the story times and mystery Mondays. Mm-hmm. 
Mm-hmm. People enjoying life, yes. Kelly Irish, mentally. Because they have life, unlike the stupid trolls. Oh, Salah. <laughs> Salah, are you trying to say I don't have a life? Is that what you're saying? Yes, Salah. your beach is clean. You think I don't have a life, Salah? Do you think that, really? Hmm. <laughs> That's the life you could have, Salah. <laughs> That's the life you could have, Salah. But no. But no. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you want to be a jerk There's instead. There's two cleaners here. Trying to get to Canada. Good luck. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> You're the same age the as Chantal. Works, the landscaping looks the, expensive. In the best shape of your life. Yeah, they spend all awesome. money on this, yeah. Yeah, Kuwait has money. Now they're playing here volleyball. A full team. You should play, Salah. Get in there. Get in there. I used to come play here with my friends, volleyball and also basketball, <laughs> also football as well. Uh-huh. Maybe I will come back and play again with my friends. Yeah. So, lovey, movementi, I don't even know. I was reading about the Emir and the dynasty in Kuwait. I wonder where that's going, that conversation. Interesting. And Salah and Chantal, which is Chantal, says, handsome, sporty man. Sporty. He's a triple, double black belt in judo, kung fu. I mean, he's a little more than sporty, Chantal. Don't underestimate your own husband. It's out of fun. It's handsome Doing sports sporty. is healthy. Salah Handsome, Beckham. sporty man. Thank you, beautiful wife. Beautiful wife. Do you get affected by Kuwait's high air pollution? Good question. Basketball also. Yeah. That'll affect your breathing. Huh. Oil refineries. Huh. Yeah. <clears throat> right. They are saying here, uh, mm -hmm. it's mean uh, barbecue or doing barbecue is not allowed. Mm -hmm. No barbecue. <clears throat> you saw his legs in Thailand. You were intimidated, John. We all were. This mean, uh, we all were. Was... Like opening fire or something like this is not allowed. He's wearing shorts so he's and during this too. But the uh, smell also bad for the like, for the weather. I haven't seen it uh, yet. But... It makes uh, pollution. You know that. Yeah, lots of pollution. Can you breathe? Your wife has COPD, emphysema, and bronchitis. Like, you should probably get, like, get her to an, a place that has healthier air quality. It is pretty bad in Kuwait. It is. You're okay, guys, be... I'm going off soon. Maybe three, four minutes. Okay, Salah. Um, where did I see it? Mrs. Chester, you're going to be 70, and I'm nowhere near as sedentary as she is. Right, Mrs. Chester? I mean, ugh, if you just sit on the floor and eat, 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 I mean... Yeah, it's not about stamina. Like, you have no cardiovascular health. Like, nothing, nothing. Can't breathe even. And I'm sure even if she could breathe, her muscles would get tired quickly. Like, it's a lot of weight to be carrying around. Oh, look. They give uh, the cat some water here. Hello. Stretching. Mm -hmm. Hi. Oh, there's two. Hi. <laughs> oh, let me show you guys. Sorry. <laughs> I'm just watching it on my monitor. <laughs> Sorry. Let me show you. The cats are cute. They are. And he does seem to know now how to, like, better deal with cats. He really had no clue at all before. Over here. Hello. Stretching. Hi. Oh, there's two. Hi. <laughs> 
Oh, they are a couple, right? Couple? A couple or siblings, guys, do you think? What? What? <laughs> Cute. What? Why are you twins? thinking like that? Or maybe twins, yeah. They look like the same. Uh, they look like mother and son to me, but whatever. What do I know? <laughs> yes, babe, so cute. We're all just guessing. The cats here. love them. Yeah, Louis. Or Louis. He doesn't understand mating. <laughs> For cats, adult people. Yeah, true. Oh, there's some boats here. Let's Why are there tires? <clears throat> Devil eggs asks. I'm thirsty and sweaty now, and also kind of tired. Burn them. That's part of the pollution problem. <laughs> no, Aaron, yeah, she's side. still in Canada. I think he... it's like old. Nobody, you, uh, nobody. You think it's like old? She's still in Canada, and he went live today on the couple's channel, just walking around. So he's doing his thing, just like when they were in Thailand, and she's just sitting in Canada, like in the chat. But the chat has been brutal, brutal. I use it anymore. <clears throat> Abandoned boat. Somebody put vacuum cleaner here. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Where are the carpets? It's kind of storage. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Not bad. Boat bees incoming. <laughs> yes. That boat's in uh, Thailand, babe. I wish. I miss them with you a lot. Aww. It was so fun. Aww. It was so fun. Good night, Sachi Bell. Okay, have a great night. Oh, have a good road trip tomorrow. Good. Oh, have fun. Nice. So our next big purchase should be a boat. <laughs> <laughs> I'll think about it. <clears throat> well, you, you, you don't have to think about it. It's up to Chantal. It's her money. I mean, really. We need that boat footage. Exactly, Jen. We do. We do. Uh, yeah, I mean... I don't know. I just wish that Salah would have greater awareness of like what he's filming. Like, don't watch where you're walking. Watch through your phone. Watch through the viewfinder or whatever you're using. Because it's like, it's all over the place. You need to like, you know, just smoothly try to pan from the side and go back. And, you know, this like herky jerky stuff. It's like, mm -mm, people aren't going to tolerate that for long. Well, I had such a great time. You needed to stop with Oh, the thanks, babe. Wouldn't she say wallahi? Wouldn't she say wallahi? I've only heard women say wallahi. Not wallah. I've heard men say wallah. I'm so glad to hear that. It's like saying, I swear. Thanks for Beezers. Thanks like for I everybody swear to God. was here with us uh, watching and uh, enjoying with us, like having fun. <laughs> <laughs> the boat footage. Is villa here. Yeah. Is it Villa? No, it's a big house. <laughs> okay, guys. Uh, take care, Salah. Thank you, Dragonfly. Thank you. Uh, good night, Lavi. What good night? It's a uh, good evening here. It's well, I think it's 6.30 right. or something. That's uh, what I thought. Salah, thank you for the work. You're welcome, right Louis went, uh, went, uh, went. Why don't they correct each other in language? Why doesn't he correct her and say, well, you're a woman, so you say, well, ahi. And... She's saying, you know, and he's always saying there's too many shells. There's too many, you know, instead of like there's a lot or there's so many. Why don't they correct each other? It's odd. Who else? Happy life. Tracy and everybody. Thank you all guys for being here and see you the next time. Uh, take care and God bless you all. God bless Goodbye. you, Salah. Mashallah. Mashallah. Okay. Very good. Fantastic. Thanks for the stream, Super Sala. Did anyone ask where's the car? No, no one did. Hmm. You're over it, Nancy? I know. I know. You said you saw the eggplant. Uh, how do you assume he can do anything smoothly? Uh, oh, what do, you, what do you mean? Like from his like grooming? Is that what you're talking about? You want to talk about Salah's eggplant? We can. I mean, though, I just, it's completely blacked out what I have. You can't see anything other than his navel and a lot of hair. That's it. So if that's what you mean, like the grooming, yeah. They can't stand each other, so they avoid really talking and correcting each other, Teoncita. Could be. I know she would probably get super, like, mean and defensive 
I think, if he did correct her. Like, I'm doing the best I can! You know, I could just see her flipping out on him, you know, on any little thing. But if he really, truly cared about her, you know, like, really, and how she's perceived in Kuwait, if he cared about that, he would correct a few things. My ex used to correct me on some stuff. Like, we don't really say it like this. And this was stuff in English. <laughs> we don't really say it like this in English. We say it like that. I'm like, well, that doesn't make sense. And he's like, I know, but that is how everybody says it. And you're going to stand out if you don't also say it incorrectly. <laughs> like, okay. So, you know, I mean, just because, you know, he didn't want me to be like on the outside, you know, he wanted me to feel included, you know, for just like with that. It's covered with the triple black metals. That's probably what <laughs> Aaron Prince, would it be offensive to participate in Ramadan if not Muslim? Well, you would only be doing certain parts of it. Um, like anyone can fast, certainly, but you wouldn't be doing the five prayers a day and staying up at night and praying, I'm sure. So, you know, you can fast along. Like I fasted in Egypt during Ramadan as long as I could as a Christian, just because I wanted to know what other people were going through and did give me a lot of perspective. Um yeah. So, yeah, there's nothing wrong with it. But you won't be doing Ramadan truly, I guess. As much as Adore Pete's was, he did correct Chantal. Adore? He was Adore? Oh. You're Buddhist, Jason, but I perceive all religions, the real ones, beautiful and ultra relevant. Of course. Anyone, anyone taking a path to a higher purpose or a higher being or a creator or however you see it, you know, I think is wonderful. And we have, oh, you meant to say do, okay. And we have people also in the nest who are agnostic or atheist. So, you know, whatever your belief is, it doesn't, you know, it doesn't matter. Well, you're welcome, regardless of, of what you believe. Sunny Days just gifted five, are you serious, memberships. Thank you, Sunny Days. Yeah, yeah. And Aaron Prince received a membership from Sunny Days, as did PG401, Mrs. Chester, DG, you just got outed as a larker, welcome, <laughs> and Christy, welcome everybody to the nest. I'll put a link in the chat for your welcome video. If you're a brand new member, you'll definitely want to go check it out. Yeah, thank you, Sunny Days. Tehansita says, I'm pagan and I respect everyone, but if you are Chantal, then I don't respect her. And hey, I don't respect her. I don't. I don't. But when it comes to, you know, the religion, it's like, it's, it, it's a deeper conversation for me. You know, it is. Because, you know, you know. So, yeah. Yeah, we have we have Wiccans, we have witches, we have pagans, we have ever we have um, Jehovah's Witnesses, we have Mormons, former Mormons in the ch in the nest. It's great, it's wonderful. I subscribe to Live and Let Live until you cross the line. Yes, Jason, I agree. You mess with kids or animals. Yes, agree. And the wrath of the unity will directly befall you thanks to social media. Okay. We needed this more than it seems on the surface. I don't like her, but I love her, if that makes sense. Sure. I get that. Yeah. Hey, Trailer Park Trophy Wife. How's it going? Oh. You love the hamster on the tank, Nancy? I Well, poor Harry. Ugh. Poor Harry is just being left out in the cold to fight in the war, and Chantal doesn't care. She said she's going back to Kuwait for Salah, and Julia. I mean, what? What? And if you missed it, if you missed it, this is just a few seconds long. Might want to check it out. Yeah, I want to go back, but I'm trying to be like patient and, you know, if it were up to me, I'd already be back there. 
but I have, I, I do have like things like, you know, promise like my family that I would go to these appointments and take care of some things I have to do here. Do some beezing before you go back. I'm not afraid of the war. I'll take my chances. I'm not going to leave him there by himself and my cat there to deal with that. I know, miles away. And that is why we're deeply concerned about Harry. We are very deeply concerned. We don't really know what's going on there. Okay, look at him. Look at him. So this is Operation Desert Storm. Look at little Harry. He's scared to death. What are you thinking, Chantal? He's your son. What are you thinking? Oh, my God. She's not happy with having to do things for her family. Right, Jen? Right? Mm-hmm. Absolutely, Dirt Merchant. You should watch my video that I posted yesterday, I think. I go all in on that. As a dude who's been to war, she should be terrified. I went all in on that. It's a like a 12-minute video. I would go check that out if you haven't, Dirt Merchant. You know, the gall and the audacity. It never ends with her. It never ends. I'm not afraid of war. When was the last time you had a gun pointing at you, you idiot? You idiot. You have no idea. You have no clue. And she looks like a moron, sorry, but she does, to anyone who has ever been in any kind of conflict, whether military, civilian, or in any way, I'm not afraid of war. I mean, it's not a video game. It's not a video game, Chantal, you know? Oh my God, BB. <gasps> BB just DM'd me. Oh my God. The best AI photo of Harry I've ever seen. I'm putting it up. I'm putting it up. It's got to go up right now. Right now. War is terrifying. It absolutely is. It absolutely is. She has no clue what she's talking about. It's infuriating sometimes. It really is. And at some point, I will talk to you guys about my experience living through the Arab Revolution. In Egypt, I was there. I was there through it all. So. And I didn't evacuate like a lot of foreigners did. And there was a point where we couldn't evacuate because um, the highway was shut down. The highway to the airport was shut down. And you couldn't get there. You just couldn't get there. It was very dangerous. Extremely dangerous. So, okay, Chantal. But you want to go back for Julia. And Salah? Okay. Her Western privilege is showing. Exactly, Sarah. Exactly. Like, clearly. I mean, what do you think this is? You think people have knives, Chantal? You think you're going to be in a knife fight? No. No. I mean, the first time I ever shot a gun was during that time. We had to have them to protect ourselves. It was, you know, really, it's not a joke. She's so clueless. I'm not afraid. I'm not afraid of anything, guys. I'm going to go back for Julia. You idiot. Why don't you stay where you are? And it could possibly be extremely safe in Kuwait. And it probably will be. Like, no one's trying to fight with Kuwait. But, you know, things can happen in the crossfire. That's a possibility. But, you know, she doesn't think about that, of course. Of course. And, uh, yeah, I mean, you're already in Canada. Why would you possibly go in? You're ridiculous. Truly. Truly. I waited too long and then I couldn't get out. So, psh, psh, psh. <laughs> uh, I want like kind of a, look at Harry. Look at him. Oh. Wrong tab. Yes. Thank you. I appreciate the blessing. Yes, I have. Yes, I have. 
But, you know, I probably don't sound like I have, like I've been through a lot in life. And people think, you know, people, you know, some people assume that I'm like, I have not a care in the world. And then I'm a generally happy person. And it's no problem. Like, I'm not, you know, like I am, but I have been through a ton of therapy. I've done a lot of processing. You know, I mean, really, it's like no one gets through life unscathed. But if you're someone like Chantal, who most likely experienced some form of trauma as a young child, because how, how did she end up the way she is? She obviously did, but she never chose to deal with it. And here she is a 40 year old person acting like she's 60, but mentally she's 12 and she can't advance throughout her life in any area at all. It's far more brave to face everything and go through therapy and do what you got to do to process it. It doesn't go away. You can't just keep stuffing it down with Putin. It doesn't go away, Chantal. It's ridiculous. And yes, I have been through a lot. But people think I'm like, oh, she's, you know, like, no, not exactly. There we go. There we go. All right. All right. Here is the image that BB just sent. Look at this. Oh my God. Look at Harry. Look at Harry. <gasps> He's got gumdrops and lollipops all around him. Oh my God. And he's holding a golden poop. That is precious. Absolutely precious, BB. Thank you. <laughs> I love Nest submitted AI images. It's the best. So cute. Thank you, BB. <laughs> Love it. Love it. <laughs> oh, it is the cutest thing ever. A sweet little guy, a little Harry. This is Harry, like after the war. And like Harry has been, he's done the work. He's done the trauma processing. He's been, he does have three feet. You're right, Chris. Why do they always mess up the feet and the hands? <laughs> hey, it's extra. It's extra power for Harry. Yeah. You know, he's already been through everything. And now he's like living the life in Candyland. He's like, he's good now. And he's got the golden poop, right? He's like, he's like, yes, I've been through some shit. But, you know, I made this shit and I made it into gold. I turned it into gold. I mean... The poop has, oh, the poop has feet. It does. <laughs> oh my God. How weird. <laughs> that makes it even better. Maybe the poop, like, can walk. Possible poop feet. Yeah. Who would have thought? The poop has feet. I love it. Foot shaped gumdrop. I love this. I love this. Oh my God. So cute. This is from BB. How many licks will it take to, him to get to that tootsie? <laughs> it is so cute. Right. Life gives you shit. Paint that shit gold. Harry is, this is like post conflict. He's chilling, living life, just loving life. Look at him. I love it. This is the best. Thank you so much, BB. This is, this is one of the best ever. That's because of nuclear fallout exposure? The extra appendages? It could be. Maybe Harry went to Chernobyl at some point, too. Possible. Possible. Um, Mariah Gems says Chicken Pickle made a good point that Chantal said her family really wants her to go to these appointments like they're deeply worried about her mental health. As they should be. As they should be. And sometimes people who are very ill aren't able to see how ill they are so you do have to kind of push a little bit you know maybe that's what they're doing could be post fallout for a hamster <laughs> harry's singing i've got a golden poo poo <laughs> i just love it because we had we had like you know wartime harry right oh poor harry Yeah, we had wartime Harry. I mean, look at him going through it. It's like, it's like owls flying all around him. 
He's being pelted with candy. I mean, the poor thing. The poor thing. Look at him over on the right side. Petrified. Absolutely petrified. The poor little guy. Chantal, you're a bad person. Look at him on the tank. Look at him on the tank. Oh, just riding along, holding on for dear life. It's so sad. How could you do this to your hamster? And look at him on the tank on the left. You can barely see him. He's so small. He's so tiny. This is a chaotic photo. That's very chaotic. But, but, look at him now. He's, oh, look at him now. He's healed. He's back to normal. He's better than normal. Look at him. <laughs> We need old retired veteran Harry on a rocking chair. Ultimate chaos. Yes. Oh, I think she knows how sick she is. She doesn't care. Hopefully her family's finally setting some boundaries. Sunny days. Hopefully. I mean, it's for her own good. You know, if she wants to live a couple more years and wants to be fairly. I mean, what would bother me? But you got to think about it. She's like 12 mentally. It wouldn't bother a 12 year old not to advance in life. They don't know what that even means. Like, you don't have a career at this point. You're just kind of like winging it every single day. And how you make your primary source of income, you don't even take it seriously. It's like, what are you doing? Oh, okay, Warschneffer, have a good meeting. The snowy owl looks super pissed. I mean, yeah. You've never seen an angry snowy owl? Oh, I have a couple pictures. I've been saving them. <laughs> yeah. Exactly why her family has to step up. It's like she just has no awareness, really. I guess. Yeah, this snowy owl was like, this is like a war cry from this owl. Like, ah! Like the scream. Mm -hmm. Chantal's mentally stuck where she is, and that is in high school. I think even before high school. Because all the stories she talks about are from elementary school. And sometimes when I'm watching her, I feel like I'm watching a preteen's YouTube channel and they're just rambling about nothing. There's no point. Just pressed record and just did the stream of consciousness like nothing. And everyone's watching it. You think 10 to 12, Jen? Me too. Me too. Hello, too cold to bother. How are you? Nice to see you. As always. Yeah. So. Stuck in middle school. Yes, definitely. Owls are kind of terrifying when they're pissed off. I know. It's the best. It's pretty cool, though, the way they fluff up. I know. <laughs> That's no owl is tired of this shit. This will stop now. Look at this one. Very determined. Marching towards us. Like, whoa. Whoa. Operation Dessert Storm. Even her alt accounts are food related, right? Sara Lee. Mm hmm. Yep. Supposed to cook dinner, Tejoncita? Have to figure out what you can eat yourself. Oh, what, what are the options? Do you have options? I know I'm hungry too, but it's kind of too late to eat. Uh, I hate that. <laughs> <laughs> Operation Enduring Fupa. Nice dirt merchant. <laughs> There's so many comments that could be made about that. Hey, 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 easy. <laughs> That's when her sister was born, Moni JV. Yeah. Hmm. You get junior high mean girl vibes, Pony Upify. Yeah. Yeah. You get a day old chicken tender in the fridge? One chicken tender, Jason? That's sad. They gotta have like three, you know? <laughs> oh, you guys, you guys are the best. Thank you so much for, oh my God, the gifted memberships today and people who joined memberships, unbelievable. And also the support through the super chats, you guys are ridiculous. Unbelievable. Thank you, Sir Austin. Snap. Operation Dessert Storm Snack Attack. Yeah. 
And Thunder Rain 666 number 31 pointed out the obsession that Foodie Beauty appears to have with birds all of a sudden. I mean, I didn't even notice that, but it's true. It is true. And Delulu just occurred. It just occurred to Delulu that Salat is goofy. <laughs> and the gifted memberships, you guys. I'm just, I'm so touched, really. Because, like, I want the nest to grow. I want to get, you know, we can expand the nest. We can fluff it out. It's always going to be comfortable. It's never going to be too crowded. So, but I'm just like, I'm just so kind of honored, I guess. I don't want to sound too dramatic, but I am. Like that you guys want to see the nest grow just as much. It, it really means a lot. Thank you, Dirt Merchant. I hope you do stick around. If you keep coming out with ideas like Operation Dessert Storm, you're going to have to. You're going to have to. Or I'll just come to Sin and Sass and track you down and ask you for your ideas. <laughs> Either one is fine. <laughs> oh, right, John. Death ain't the worst thing. You said this the other day, too, about war. And that's how I ended my shorter video about it with your quote. Like my 12 minute video about poor Harry. Um, death ain't the worst thing. Imagine kidney failure, diabetes, holes all over her arms and lost both legs to the sugar foots. I mean, when she's when it starts to go downhill even more, it's going to be bad. And she'll still have nothing but food to make herself feel better. And that's just it's going to be a very bad cycle. That's going to be a cycle. Ugh. Thank you, Francis. I love having you here. Raised day-to-day vlogs. Y'all kept me company as I cooked dinner and now packing lunches and cleaning up. Awesome. Glad to keep you company. Operation Dessert Storm mission accomplished, little seven. Yes. <laughs> it is always a good time here. It really is. And that's because of you guys. You like the vibe here? Eight little paws? Me too. Most of the time you just observe and rarely comment. Well, I'm glad you're commenting now. Nancy Jennings. Thank you. I have prayed for Chantal. God said thank you, but it takes two to tango. She's not listening. My name is not Cheese. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Kavella. Thank you, Nancy. It does, yeah. That's the thing, you know? You sent another pic? Okay, let me take a look. Let me take a quick look. One of my dogs is at the door. You want to go out? They've been so good today. Oh, my God. I don't think they barked once. I was really like, let's go outside. Let's keep going outside. Let's get it out of your system, guys, before I go live. Because it's been a little, you know. Oh, my. Oh, BB. All right, we will, <laughs> we, <laughs> we will definitely show this next time. That'll be our cliffhanger for tonight. He's old and retired now. The stress of war aged him and grayed his hair. We got a gray-haired Harry. But he's chilling. He's chilling. I love it. Thank you, PB. <laughs> it's the best. Can we go out on Holy Spirit Activate? Of course we should. Absolutely. Yes. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. Everybody, thanks again. Thank you so much for being here. I truly appreciate all of you. And each one of you makes the nest what it is. And I love it. I do. Thank you, Anna Gags. All right, here we go. Hold on to your hats. We got some uh, tuk-tuk. And we're activating the Holy Spirit right now. Okay, good night, everybody. They say I ain't saved cause I cuss a little bit But you're the only judge that I need and that's it They always in my business cause they say I backslid They read the Holy Bible but they ain't applying it So Holy Spirit activate If you do it right now that would be great I ain't trying to smack this chick in the face Don't you see me down here trying to change my way So Holy Spirit You better do it Lord Holy Spirit You better get them Lord <laughs> Before I get them Lord Hey Hey Better do it, Lord. You better get them, Lord. Before I get them, Lord. Hey. 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 
They say I ain't safe cause I cuss a little bit But you're the only judge that I need and that's it They always in my business cause they say I backslid They read the Holy Bible but they ain't applying it So Holy Spirit activate If you do it right now that would be great I ain't trying to smack this chick in the face Don't you see me down here trying to change my way So Holy Spirit You better do it Lord You better get them Lord <laughs> Before I get them Lord Hey you better do it, Lord. You better get him, Lord. Before I get him, Lord. Hey. 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 They say I ain't safe cause I cuss a little bit. But you're the only judge that I need and that's it. They always in my business cause they say I backslid. They read the Holy Bible but they ain't applying it. So Holy Spirit activate. If you do it right now, that would be great. I ain't trying to smack this chick in the face. Don't you see me down here trying to change my way. So Holy Spirit You better do it, Lord. You better get him, Lord. <laughs> Before I get him, Lord. Hey, 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 hey. They say I ain't safe cause I cuss a little bit But you're the only judge that I need and that's it They always in my business cause they say I backslid They read the Holy Bible but they ain't applying it The Holy Spirit activate If you do it right now, that's good